Meanwhile, the New Nigerian People's Party has called on all stakeholders, including party spokespersons and supporters, to ensure ethical use of social media during the campaign season ahead of the 2023 election. This was disclosed at a national social media training program organized by the party yesterday in Abuja. The presidential candidate of the NNPP, Senator Vabiu Kwankwaso, spoke against abuse, abuse, lies and propaganda which were often evident in social media mobilization. Amadi Okbewe has more on the story. The New Nigeria People's Party, NNPP, on Tuesday in Abuja organized a national social media training program to educate his publicity secretaries, media aides to candidates and social media activists and supporters on the need to ensure a clean and ethical campaign on social media ahead of the 2023 elections. Speaking at the program, the presidential candidate of the NNPP, Senator Rabiu Kwankoso, represented by Abdullah Ibichi, condemned the use of social media to spread lies, abuse and propaganda and urged participants to do better. It is also important to draw attention to the need that while we at the NNPP are working hard to win election, to save this country, to rescue this country, to rebuild this country, it is important to see that we cannot correct wrong with another wrong. So our keyboard warriors, our social media activists, in doing this campaign, in doing this struggle, we must be able to do a clean fight, a clean struggle. No abuses, no insults, no lies, no any negative propaganda against anybody, against anyone. The national chairman of the party, Professor Rufai Alkali, spoke against recent polls that preempted the campaign season. He added that social media would play a great role in the coming elections while advising cautious usage. Everything people have tried to get about him, they could not get something wrong about him. That's why they say we are going to hand over our ticket to some other people who are always sleeping in even so you saw your occasion. How can a presidential candidate be sleeping <laughs> even before the campaign starts? It doesn't work. <laughs> so it means that if you, are, you, are, you, are, you elect a sleeping president, then you have a sleeping president for the next four years. Is that what we want? No. no. It's a living president. No. If you think that you are there, you are a winner on social media, you remain a winner on social media. But when the time comes to vote, then you see the, those who are going to win by the votes and authentic votes. So please, we want people not to, uh, you know, uh, take things for granted. NMPP is, we are talking about social media because we believe that nobody should be left behind. But the reality is that Nigerians, we should not vote for a sleeping president. On his part, the National Publicity Secretary of the party, Dr. Agbo Major, said the training was necessary to teach members on proper response to negativity and also to clear up misconceptions about the party logo. We have seen of late our boys reacting to issues like that. So what, one of the things we want to achieve here is to get them to understand the need not to be reacting to such negative things. We'll stay focused on issues. We'll be discussing with Nigerians what we want to do for them by the time we eventually get to power next year. So these are some of the basic things we want to achieve. So this program is to ensure that we have a uniform logo, which is the logo on the INEC website. So rising up from this event, what is expected is that all posts done using any social media channel would be done with the right and appropriate logo. Various political parties have begun final preparations as the campaigns will officially kick off on the 29th of September. In another story,